So this is it guys, Overwatch is releasing its final event. Hello everybody and welcome to the channel, I am Warstorm and today we've got a lot of good news for you regarding the channel and Overwatch. Starting out with Overwatch news, we have a new community update. On April 5th, Overwatch will have an anniversary remix event. Here's the post from the Blizzard forums that kind of briefly go over what to expect in this event and the future of Overwatch. Feel free to read or pause this at any time you want, but basically this goes over the anniversary event at which it is going to entail a release of old Overwatch skins that have been unvaulted can now access again, plus some alterations to previous skins you can get now they're also bringing back some events that people love like lucio ball may snowball challenge and much more but what i really want to get into is the fact that this is probably going to be the last event they have for overwatch before overwatch 2 is released as stated down here this does mean that the event like archives standard anniversary and summer games will not make a return this year Instead, the anniversary remix events will be introducing a new set of variants in place of the normal event schedule, all of which will transfer to Overwatch 2 along with all previously earned skins, sprays, and player icons. So to sum this up for you guys, this is an event if you want to play, I would highly suggest you play just because maybe these skins will not be coming back. You never know. I'm sure they might eventually release them, but it sounds like this is going to be the last event. So I would go on the grind at least one more time bag these skins it's all going to carry over to overwatch 2 and you'll be set but if you miss out you never know you might actually miss out for good now moving on to some of the skins they're bringing back we have the Ana one right here i believe we call it basset this is an old skin they have just come out with again you have the baptiste reunion skin back out and right here you have nano diva now here's where things change up a little bit these are still old skins but they have reskinned them i know to some people this might be a little bit of disappointing but they did state in the previous post that I put down that they are doing this for a reason so they can focus a lot more on Overwatch 2. If they're too busy making new skins for Overwatch 1, which we all know is going to be trash anyway and replaced with Overwatch 2, they basically just reskinned old skins. So first off, we have Diva's cat skin. You can see here it's all white. She's got red hair. My new favorite skin and my favorite color scheme of all time is the new Oni Genji skin with red and white. Cleanest one ever, don't at me. A white and blue witch mercy. This one's actually not as good as the original, but I still like it. The witch doctor reaper raven skin. That's also white instead of the normal black. This one's actually gonna be definitely one of my favorites as well. Probably one of the coolest Reinhardt knight skins ever. This reskin with a white and green is just one of the best ever. Kind of reminds you of the original Genji skin. So I'm definitely going to be grounded for this one. And finally, we have Cultist Zenyatta with white. This one is definitely my top pick as well. Now for some channel update stuff. So far, I haven't got an update on whether or not I'm going to be able to participate in the closed beta coming up on Overwatch 2. And with Overwatch 2 eventually coming out, I'm still on the fence whether or not I should make guide videos for each individual hero. Knowing good and well, they're probably going to change them completely. And the way the meta is going to switch over with one tank and still having two healers is going to be all over the place. Hopefully, though, we'll get into the beta so I can actually start making some real content on Overwatch 2 coming out. That would be 100% hype. But if you guys really want to help me out, please leave me a comment down below on what you think I should do. If you want to see more guide videos, I can still make some specific guide videos. I was thinking about making one about how to create space. Just a video on that for tanks. But overall, just let me know what you think. Let me know what you think about the update coming up. Are you pretty disappointed about it? Or do you understand? Or are you pretty excited for it? Me overall, because I am returning to Overwatch, I'm actually pretty excited about it, especially for the Genji skin. Genji's my favorite. That's my favorite color scheme. I'm pretty hyped for it, honestly. So you're gonna be seeing me grinding that a lot, may even stream. But overall, if you guys liked the video, please hit that like button. It helps the channel out a lot. Again, leave a comment. It helps the channel out a lot more. More engagement, the better. Made it this far, though. Please hit that subscribe button. If you don't like it, I will give you your money back. I promise. Anyway, guys, that's going to do it. Hope you guys have a good one. Peace out.